I praise God very highly for Pastor Timothy Yip and his teachings. I believe these teachings are directly from the Holy Spirit because these are teachings that we have not heard in this part of Africa, but they are very helpful, especially to mention the love of God or God's love. We have been trying to force people into believing or into serving God. But we have learned now that serving God is not a matter of force, but it's a matter of understanding how God loves you and you can serve Him better. Not out of compulsion, but out of the love that God has for you. And that was very motivating to us that we should serve God out of motivation and not out of force. And we also discovered that indeed, we have been forcing ourselves using strength to fight the enemy for healing, deliverance. But the teachings of Pastor Timothy Yep have made us to understand that your relationship with God is what matters. And it's what that solves the problem. It's not how much force you apply. Because the Bible even told us that it's not by power, it's not by might. So that has helped us a long way to understand that indeed we just need to relax and allow the Holy Spirit to do the work. And from his prayers, there are a lot of testimonies. And we saw him demonstrate that, that it's not by power, but by the Spirit. He just lay hands on people, and the power of God move. And things happen. Deliverance take place. So that was a practical application of what he was teaching us, that he never had to shop our head, receive, receive, demon go, demon go, but just by touching either the shoulder, the enemy take leave because of the relationship with God. So such a teaching we needed in this country, we needed in Liberia, we needed even in the war. And I hope people eyes will be open to such a teachings because that's the only means by which we can actually love God. And when it comes to the counseling, very true that we got to know that there is a difference between counseling and teaching. Many of us have been teaching, 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 and as a result, our results have been very minimal. But we discover from Pastor Timothy Yev's teaching that counseling is different from teaching. And you can only teach people who are willing to learn, but not people who are not willing to learn. And people who are not willing to learn must be counseled first so that you can motivate them to desire the learning and then before you can go ahead with the teaching. So that also help us and we also help our ministries. Like as a testimony, just yesterday after the teaching, I was able to call back home to find out from some of my members and they told me that they were not in church. So instead of using uh, condemnation, instead of using rebuke, I use motivation. And they got that, they got to understand that indeed they regretted why they were not in service on Sunday. But in the past, I would have used authority. I would have used condemnation. But I used the grace method. And that was able to make them to feel guilty that they missed the presence of God. In Jesus' name. So I also called a sister who have left church for almost two years. And based on the using the method of the Pastor Timothy Yip, I discovered that she was so happy and she said, in fact, as I'm going back to Liberia, she is going to be one of those that will welcome me at the airport. So, and that only came about by applying the grace method of motivation. But I have been using condemnation, accusation. And because of accusation, I have not gotten any substantial results but by reason of using the grace method the lady that could not come to church for two years decided that in fact she will go and receive me at the airport so that's how beneficial this training is to us in africa and we wish that pastor yep tomato yep will always come and transform the ministries in liberia africa and even our very life equip us to teach the other people. One of the things I also understood from the teaching is the right division between the love of God 
and also the judgment of God. Many people have been teaching the love of God, but they have never given us the balance where they told us that when God loves you and he can never take any negative action against you. But Pastor Timothy Yip was able to make us to understand that indeed God loves us. The love of God is available for us, but equally so, God cherish our relationship with him. He also expect us to live a holy life to maintain that relationship. If not, destruction will surely await us. So that is a balanced teaching of grace and also the law. So I highly appreciate this servant, this missionary, Pastor Timothy Ye. And I hope we in Africa will practicalize what the Holy Ghost have taught us through him. Glory to God. Thank yes, you. Thank and you, what sir. is your name, sir? I'm Pastor Gosson Tumbe Divine from Liberia, from the Tabernacle of God Assembly, Toka International. Mm -hmm. And you have come to Nigeria here to be with me in this ministry here. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. Because I love the teaching so much. And I, yesterday when you also lay hands on me to impact, I felt the glory of God coming upon me from the crown of my head to the soles of my feet. I saw like your spirit was being transferred into me. And I began to feel the joy of the Lord. And I began to feel the anointing more increase in my life. Mm -hmm.